All right, so we are about to get ready to ship out our shirt orders. Good morning. Um, so <laughs> your girl got like a little scale. And okay, so I got my little process going, my little process, my little process. I'm working with Ship Station because um, the Reed and Righteous and Ratchet, they have their own little code. So I went through them and I was able to create my own. I'm not going to show you guys this because then I'll be showing you addresses. But I was able to create my own shipping label like after i weighed it in its entirety um i got these mailers aren't these cute these mailers from amazon and then i got tissue paper and these little thank you stickers and so um my manufacturer diamo she already she uh sells the shirts in these little things here so that's already good for me the other shirts i need to ask her where she gets these um but anyway so i'm doing that today putting them all on here, making sure I'm doing it carefully, doing it correctly. I bought the labels. Um, I don't know if y'all can see that line there. And so they'll print out here and I'll just slap them on here and I'll drop them off. And the postage comes on there already because I have a stamps.com thing um, account. So yeah, we're good to go. It's just getting it done. And so then in my Wix account, it also has like a little checklist. So that's what we're gonna be doing today. So all the orders are ready to ship. Drop it off at the post office. No. I did it! I did it! All right, so bag is empty. I did it! I wish I could have recorded, but the clerk, she was like, oh, you did a good job. You did it right. Why was I looking for my phone? Why was I looking for my phone? Anyway, um, she's like, you did it right. So the weights were correct, and I chose the correct. I just, I just did good, so... Um, YouTube University is a thing. It's real. You guys need to attend. Uh, graduated magna cum laude. Okay. But um, yeah, so all the packages are out. I got the tracking numbers. Let's go. Okay, one thing I hate about Houston, but also love about Houston is that it's like whatever food you want, you can get it. Okay. Um, and so I think that has contributed to my weight gain because... I'd be on the go and any literally anything I could think of, it'd be right there. One time I was like, I, why don't they make sushi in a burrito form? Child, it was a place around the corner that had sushi burritos, child. I, I kid you not. Okay, so anyway, um, when I used to work in this area, I found this place that has acai bowls and it's like genuine, pure acai straight from Brazil, okay? Um, I'm talking about the owners are Brazilian and everything. I hope it's acai Brazil. Yeah, it is. Okay, so um, every time I'm off or like on a weekend or when I'm thinking about it, I like to go get me an acai bowl, which it, it is like really sweet, but it is um, better for you than like Carl Jr. or El Pollo Loco or all these other places, right? And it's a bomb. So I try to go get me something before I go grocery shopping. Otherwise, I'm going to buy everything in A to B. You hear me? Good morning, guys. Guys, look at Kobe. My husband just went to the gym. He just was sitting by the door just crying. Like, please come back. He'll be back. Look at him. He'll be back. I do some things around. I really believe in like feng shui. Okay, for the new year, like I told you guys before. So these were white. I changed them to blue. I painted them. Just kidding. Uh, <laughs> changed like the centerpieces. I flipped these two pictures. Um, and the thing is, the thing is, when you don't have a whole lot of space, it can be hard to um, feng shui it out. Okay. But you have to figure out a way because you gotta like re you gotta reinvent your space um, because we don't have a house yet. Okay, so I cleaned up the bar, dusted all that off, separated darks, lights. The wine is down there, um, and then you guys don't know this, but I tried to keep every Essence magazine 
Um, so I have, that's the most recent one. I got Allure, I don't know, somehow, I think through Shoe Dazzle. Um, but Zendaya was on there, so I kept that. Glamour with Ava, Auntie Maxine, Ebony with Michael Jackson, 50 Greatest Male Singers of All Time. I got Janet, I got Chadwick Boseman, I got Michael B. Jordan, um, Tracy Ellis Ross, Jody Turner Smith, Yara Shahidi, Kerry Washington. Um, so yeah, all right, it's New Year's Eve night, and my husband has to work, so for the second year in a row, I am going to get all dolled up and head there, um, and just eat there and drink there, and so then I can bring the year in with him. Of course, I have my black eyed peas on, I have the greens in the crock pot. And so in the morning, I'm gonna fry some chicken, make some cornbread and make some macaroni and cheese. And I'm thinking about a pound cake. Um, I know, I know we as a people, we got to do better with the food, but tradition is black eyed peas and greens. Like you need to have those, you need to have those. Okay, so um, I am making sure that we eat that. And so let me see what else. Oh, so. Um, I recorded my podcast earlier. These nails, they're so thin. I'm thinking about going back to dip. I'm trying not to. I'm trying not to. But anyway, I'm going to get all the up. <sighs> my dog. Every He just keeps pooping. Every time I think, okay, I've got it all cleaned up, here you go. Pooping again. And it don't smell good. We got to get a house so we can get a doggy door. So he could do his business outside. All right, y'all tried to do a little something, something. Just a little bit. Oh my God. Come on with this blazer. My husband got a cool two minutes to get up here. One minute. I'm giving him one minute. Child, the greens are ready. Let me see. The black eyed peas are ready. I tried to make it like very small portions. I think I finally figured it out. I can see the bottom of the pot. That's how small of a portion I made. I mixed mine together. I could not wait because the day is moving and I have not had my good luck stuff. Cornbread. Okay. I got mac and cheese in the oven, fried chicken, and white rice. All right, so I got my cornbread, my mac and cheese in there, my greens, my beans, my fried chicken. I just put a piece in there because it's a lot of food. And I'm watching All right, so I'm halfway done. Even though I filled this up last night, we're trying to finish, we're trying to make this a thing that I always do. Um, I was doing it uh, when I was teaching, but it's hard to get a, a pee break. But anyway, <laughs> Chada just hit me. Woo! Kobe was looking at me so crazy. So I'm watching this show called Raising Dion. I think it's Michael B. Jordan's movie or show or series on Netflix. And I really like it so far. This kid has magic. But he's trying to get it controlled. But he's also dealing with like being a black kid in America and the mom's a single parent and it's pretty nice. I like it. Somebody just got a bath. Kobe. Kobe, your dad's calling you. Come here. Kobe. Kobe. <laughs> Come here. Come here. 
Come here. <laughs> hey, go. 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 Hey, guys. Woo. All right, so I'm headed to Habe Labe. items for me so I'm headed down here to see if we got it um, but this is the way you do it okay nanny nanny knows what she's doing okay um on another note why do I feel like the piece of hair is on me anyway on another note I am also headed to the post office because I got a couple more shirt orders to drop off Black market is tonight, and my husband, news flash, my husband said that he want to go. I said, what? Now, let me not lie. He ain't said he want to go. He said he don't mind going, or I'll go, is what he said. So, we're going to take that, and we're going to go, okay? Now, look at this when you first walk into J.C. Penny. <laughs> it must got a line like Target for Black History Month, maybe. Oh, yeah, yeah. I think that's what's going on. Mm. I know I'm, I'm buying one today. <laughs> and I normally don't, but because it caught my attention like that. Mm -hmm. So, you know what? They ought to get some props for that because they. It's because, right in the front. Yeah, yeah. Because it caught my attention. I'm going to make a purchase. Somebody mm. had a. a Extremely wonderful idea. Yes, they did because we both about to buy. Okay. Today. <laughs> and you see that big old gap there, so people been actually. Mm -hmm. Look at these shirts. I know Target has theirs out. <laughs> Aren't you scared? Go home. You ready to go home? Let's go home. Go to your seat. Go. Can I sit down? Can I sit down, please? Go. 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 Stay. Thank you. Good boy. What's up? What's on the adventure list for today? 
your girl Camarize is headed to the city. <laughs> All right, so I'm about to go to this twerkology 101 class. This is the type of stuff I like to do. I can never find nobody to like, not nobody here anyway, to go with me to stuff like this, right? Uh, consistently, and the thing is, me and my husband, we live outside of Houston. Um, which I mean, it's not really outside of Houston, but it's outside of Houston. But um, so when you go to stuff like this, how I like to do sporadically, spontaneously, a lot of times you can't rally a bunch of people to go with you. Fine, fair. Plus, I have not established a crew yet because I just moved here, right? A year ago. Anyway, um, I'm going to official CJ, CJ, official CJ the trainer. He does the, the twerking on Instagram, y'all. He be killing it, okay? So I'm gonna give him a t-shirt. Um, I'm wearing my shirt. Maybe I'll network with a couple people there and also get my twerk on, okay? So I wore shorts, my little waist trainer. I got my knee brace on, because if y'all follow him, if y'all seen him, he do not play around. He do not play around when it comes to the twerking, okay? And I, I got to dust, I got to dust myself off a little bit because I ain't twerked in a bit. All right, but that's where we're headed. I'll try to get some footage for y'all. Now me and CJ about to have matching knee braces. Hi guys, my name is CJ, Chris, CJ, C the Train, whatever you want to call me. Um, if it was the first time coming here, raise your hand. If you're a turn, raise your hand. Okay, alright, okay, new faces, this is an answer for many faces. Um, I only got three rules. I like Chris's rules because they kind of go with mine. My three rules is first, please have fun enjoying yourself. This is a non judgmental class. I don't care what size you came in here. Right leg, so it's right, left, then both. Okay. Right. Everybody over here. Boom. Left leg. Boom. Now both. 